Hello, monsters around here, and welcome to Blood Bowl 3, which is out on the 23rd of February, I think? I believe that's true. I believe that's correct. And, of course, this is based on the tabletop board game Blood Bowl, which is probably one of the the best... the best small games workshop games they've ever made. If you don't know what Blood Bowl is, it's basically American rugby, but with orcs, so much better. But with sort of like RPG elements in between, so you have you can upgrade your players with new skills and stuff. Basically, it's just great. I spent a lot of my teenage years playing this on the tabletop. However, I will say that I didn't... Back in my day, right, we didn't have teams like Black Orc and Imperial Nobility. It was just like Orcs and humans and chaos and skaven and now you've got things like chaos renegades and old world alliance and i don't know how i feel about that but there's no wood elves so i'm probably okay with at the moment because they are my nemesis anyway of all the new races i have created a team called the wakefield wanderers and they are made up of pestigors these guys here of bloaters these guys here of rotter linemen these guys here and also, the occasional rot spawn. Now, if you've never played Blood Bowl on the tabletop, this is probably not going to look that meaningful to you. But trust me when I say the Pestigors are pretty fast, but they don't, you know, generally their skills are fairly average otherwise. The Bloaters, though, are very strong. They may be slow, but they're very strong. The Rot Alignment are garbage, but that's okay because we can make new ones. And also, the Rot Spawn is an absolute monster, literally, but is stupid. So, might not do anything. So, the Pestigors, as I say, pretty fast defeat, reasonable agility. They don't tend to have any decent skills, though, to start off with. However, with that said, I have already played a match with the Wakefield Wanderers, which is what my team is called. And uh, Cedric here managed to score two touchdowns, and so he now has sure hands. That's right, ladies. You're safe in his hands. I'll be it sticky. And uh, Matthew here picks up Grab, which is quite nice. And the Schnip picks up Brawler, which is very, very useful. And the reason that Brawler is very, very useful is because, at its core, Blood Bowl is all about limiting the bad things that happen to you because when bad things happen to you it's the opponent's turn so you want to try and limit when that happens and because it's a dice based game you can't really ever be sure it won't be so you just try to try and sort of like weigh the averages now you can upgrade your team with apothecaries cheerleaders assistant coaches dedicated fans Rerolls, that kind of thing. Currently, we don't have any rerolls, which is probably not ideal, but I just went with the basic out layer of a team because I didn't really know what else to do. Uh, you can recruit new guys, including, you know, Chile can get a reroll if we have 140,000. We don't, we just have 50,000. Uh, we can get more dedicated fans, assistant coaches. That, I don't know what to, uh, Brings a bonus to certain kickoff. That's what they do. And cheerleaders, uh, certain bonuses on certain kickoff events, such as cheering fans. Yeah. I would like an apothecary, but I don't think... I mean, to be honest, as Nurgle, we have most of our characters have regeneration, which means it's not usually going to be that important, to be honest. Um, so I guess that's fine. I also have a bunch of customization, so you can change your emblem and the color and all that kind of good stuff. There's a bunch of other things here as well, but there's currently only one single option. So, for example, cheerleaders. We only have human... Where's my sexy goat cheerleaders? Hmm? Hmm? Where are they? I'm assuming it's... Uh, I, I think it might be microtransactions. I'm not 100% sure, but it's either DLC or microtransactions, which, yeah, I'm not so sure about, but still. Whatever. Anyway, so we are currently involved in a an active competition. I've created one. It's mostly just... Uh, a, well, in fact, it's, it's all AI. It's all AI teams. There they are. Uh, currently, we're up against the Skaven team. Fair enough. We do have a slightly higher team value than everyone else because obviously we played a match and they haven't. Uh, but let's just get straight into it.
tired of getting trampled? Dreaming of the big guy silhouette? Run fast, they are runts! I'm Varagutua! And I'm Lord Borak. We at Oculus have developed a personalized training program for weak scumbags like you. You'll be out there crushing orcs in only four weeks. Join Fitness Club Oculus and finally become the big guy of the match. Welcome back, Blood Bowl fans. Okay, so we've got a slightly better fan factor, which means we should get more money at the end, I think, which is always good. Uh, we could spend some money here, but I'm not going to. I don't think we really can get too much, to be honest. So we're just going to go Buffalo ready. Wants to see blood flow. Is there anything more beautiful, Bob? One of your players without the loader trait available for this dive gains a stab trait. For this oh, oh, interesting. Have to, uh... Oh, we... I will kick the ball. So, who got the stab trait? Oh, I don't really... You just stay there. Who the hell got it? Alright, well, right, what? Yeah, run, you go there. You go there. Um... You just go up here. Okay, that'll do. That'll do. Okay, so the opponents are Skaven, and we can kick the ball, so we can kick it, and obviously it will potentially roll off. Now, if it rolls off the board, then uh, they can basically give it to anyone they like, so you have to put it somewhere sort of sensible. We'll boot it over there. Uh, the each team gets a free bribe. Away. They right, I kicked it off the board, which means this ratty now has it. That's a problem. And it is their turn. So it depends. Well, they, they're probably going to try and run past me. Because Skaven obviously are quite a dodgy team. They will try and uh, sneak past me and get to the end zone with the ball. And we're going to try and stop them, kick the shit out of them, and take the ball back. And ideally, put some of them in hospital. Now, some of these guys are linesmen. They don't have any skills. However, some of them will be blitzers, and they will come with the block skill. They are slightly more dangerous to try and tackle head-on. But it can still be done. I will say the AI is a little bit slow sometimes, particularly when it wants to decide if it's trying to use rerolls. Like Reynolds. this. Actually hates sport and would rather play with action figures instead. This has nothing to do with him bad mouthing me in that last issue. Oh, look at this! Failed dodge. So that's going to be a turnover. I can tentacle. He goes down. Because he's gone down, that's now a turnover, which means it's my go. That's unfortunate for the ratties. Right, now, because we're not too, right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna move you up. And I'm going to move you up. And if the player we... is pushed here, it will finish in the public. And in general, fans are much more dangerous than players. Yes, we do have to be careful of that. So, we're going to start with... Mm, right, okay, we're going to move you up here. So, let's move Sekendar there. We're going to get Jalen... It, we don't want to rush him. We're just... We're just going to move him normally. Now, because they're over this side, we can generally just move our boys in this direction. Because basically, we want to try and get the ball off them at this point. So, I want to try and not rush, ideally. If I go, like, there... I'm going to put you there... And then I'm going to blitz you. Now, basically, what I'm going to do, I'm going to hit this guy. Apparently, wizards call that Ooh. kinetic energy. 
Not a good result. Both of us are going to go down, but... We're both fine. The ball's been kicked out of that square. It's now over here, which means these guys are probably going to catch it. However, if they need to get past us, there's going to be a lot of dodges to do. So they did manage to dodge. He's picked it up. Something memorable or funny here. And they're going to start scampering around. Risky play. They may decide to throw the ball, but I, I'm dubious. Okay, they've they've failed a dodge, which means they could use a re-roll. So they've got three re-rolls, but only three roll re-rolls for each turn of the each side of the game, because there's 16, 16 turns for each half. I think. So he hasn't done that. He's down. Oh, he has been injured. They've got the apothecary there. Uh, he's now stunned. But that has used their apothecary for this. So they can't they can't use their apothecary again. So if they take a if they take a beating now. So what I could do. Oh, you have to dodge there, which is not really what I want to do. Right, what about if we do Okay, let's just Right, you go. You go there, because that way he has to dodge away from you and then use more of his movement to get around. That's my preference. This is fine for the moment. I'm not too worried about that. But what I do want to do is take this guy out. Uh, that's fine. We can do defender stumbles. Ah, using an ancient and we'll push forwards. We that player later. And we've knocked him out. He's out. So basically, he will be out for at least the rest of this, this half, I think. Um, so obviously, that's going to be good for us. And bad for them. If I... Now, I really want to blitz you. So I'm going to do this. You're going to stand up, and then you're going to blitz. Surrounded by adversaries like that. I hope he knows what he's doing. Uh, we're going to do that. We're not going to follow up because it's risky. If we get knocked into the crowd, that's bad. It's very bad. Do not, do not want that to happen. Um, I'm going to move you over here. It's a risky position to be in anyway, to be honest. Basically, I want to make it as unlikely as possible. We could foul him. But we're in the tackle zone, so it's not really ideal. Okay, let's just... I'm going to run out of time. I think we're just going to leave it. Bob, did you know that there are all Skaven leagues played in great caverns underground? I don't like this. The teams are backed by the powerful greater clans. So you have okay. clan Sky. They're teams, using it. The... Clan Eshin teams, and so on. Wait, is that... Wait, what? Okay, dodged. He got out of there, but he's now further back into his... His end of the zone. What's he going to do now? Oh, he did not. That didn't go well. Okay, that worked out for us. Right. So, I want to get to him. To do that, I'm going to have to... Smash some ratties. And hopefully... Oh, perfect. Ah, using an ancient blood bowl technique. Uh, we will follow up. That player better get up. Nothing good comes from spending any time on the ground in this game. Because we've got guys around who aren't currently marked, we can get an assist, which increases the strength. That is exactly what I wanted. I'm going to stay put. Now his body can move freely. Another player on the ground. The coach will be spitting teeth about this. Uh, not really. Oh, I shouldn't have used him. Well. Well, I mean, we're in no rush. What I want to do is get rid of some of these guys, but because they're blitzers, they have the block skill, which means that if we get a both down, then only we'll go down, which obviously isn't really what we want. Um, I could potentially try this, but... We could, we could do this. Okay, that's fine. Oh, God damn it. 
Oh, that's a good tap. Yeah. He's going to sleep. Oh, and he's KO'd. We'll see him on the pitch later. And he's injured. Oh, no. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. He was just, he was just, he's just knocked out. He's fine. Still, to lose one of our guys to our own blitz is um, rough. I don't want these, these guys scallywagging around down there. And I still don't like being so close to the... Uh... Okay, you're going down there. You are failing. That's good. Cabal Vision HD comes with a range of new features. Please see your instruction guide for further details. Hmm? Uh, uh sure, I use tentacles. If a bad squad, they need to fire the player that can't dodge, or have them assassinated. <laughs> oh, uh, bunch of incompetent kids. Okay. If I had my way, I'd flog them all. Oh, too easy. I really want to push you over there, but no, we're just going to stay. That's it. You go over there. I want you down. Perfect. And then, with any luck, this won't go horribly wrong this time. Okay, not quite what I wanted, but... I'll take it. There's a lot going on over here which I do not like. I really... Oh, well, to be honest, because we, because you're down, we can oh now dear. potentially... I that player has written a will, Bob. Written? Um, I can re-roll that. Speak, Jim, okay, write. we'll take Defender you Stumbles. Know, I'll kick you over them. there. We'll follow up. Down goes the rat ogre. Get up or get off the field. That works. Then we can potentially take you down. It's mm, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna move you over here. Because that's gonna make that more awkward for you to move around. In fact, I'm gonna move you down here as well, because that makes that double awkward. And then we're gonna try and take a you on. Perfect. That's you, exactly what we needed. And the end of our turn. So far, so good. End turn. That's yeah, fine. I'm just going to end the turn. That player Sorry. should punch the other enemy players quickly before trying anything else. Agreed. That seems like the best strategy. What are you going to do? Are you going to do anything? Trying to decide if you can run. Oh, are you going to throw the ball? Are you going to throw the ball? Are you going to throw? That would be very ballsy. The fuck happened there? Did you just knock your own guy out? What? Holy shit, you did. Animal savagery. Loner, frenzy. Oh, I guess sometimes you just decide to maul your own team. Oh well. Works nice. for me. Very nice. No, bad. Very bad. That's it. Fall over. On your ass. It's where you belong. Well, those cheerleaders must be exhausted. It's waggling their arms around for hours. Oh, you just used your, you used your re-roll. Interesting. You don't have any re-rolls anymore. Still, they have kind of broken around the flank, which is a slight issue. One we could remedy. Apparently, wizards call that kinetic energy. 
Follow up. Oh, ho, ho, nasty. He's down. Okay, that's good. We'll lumber over here. Uh, if I bring you... Mm, I don't really want to make you rush. Okay, let's bring you down here. I would like... Um, I want to take that rat ogre down, ideally. Okay, let's do a little rush over here. We only need more than the two. We're fine. I mean, I do tend to just prefer kicking the shit out of people more than anything else. Uh, if we go over there, and then you can come over here, and then we can do Nothing something better like that. than hitting someone smaller than you, Jim. I'm just gonna stay put. That way looks almost competent. Oh, and did he take an injury? He was just stuns. Okay, everyone happy? I'm happy. So far, so good. Will it make a difference? So he's got the ball. However, we're all over him. He's going to try and blitz us. Is he going to push? He's going to push. That's not really going to help them. I mean, they could try and throw the ball, but I don't think that's going to be a necessarily good option. Well done. He helped the ball carrier. We're fine. Making a break for it. Right next to a teammate. The rat ogre's gone stupid, which is good. So I'm gonna put you there. And then we're gonna blitz you and hope for the best. That's what we wanted. A prone player is a dead player. Off times at any rate. Okay. I'm just gonna stay there. Let's move Cedric. Uh, you can come down here. And then I think we can just do some general sort of mauling. To come out on top. Just some general, general mauling. And maybe a little bit of fouling. Yeah, let's do some fouling. Well, didn't manage to break through his armor. Shame. Okay, we'll move you there. I'm going to move you down here. Saw it. Basically, I'll kick the shit out of them until they don't have enough players. And then once they've run out of players, well, they're kind of screwed at that point. Well, they fumbled the ball, which gives us a turnover. Now, we've only got one turn before half. Well, we've got two turns, but that's not nearly enough time to actually reach the end zone, even if we pick up the ball. So, with that in mind, I think we're just going to go for general sort of mauling. Ah, fight for action. That player better get up. Nothing good comes from spending any time on the ground in this game. Hey, that play looked almost competent. Broken arm. Oof. They're going to spend time on the bench for that. Uh, let's see if we can blitz you. 
Okay, that's not the worst thing that could have happened. You three plus hey, dodge. You did it. Pick up the ball. Yes, they picked up the ball. Good job, Whoopie Cedric. Whoopee dee doo indeed. Okay. We're a little bit vulnerable there, but I don't think we can make I don't think we can make it in one in one turn. Um it's it's a ballsy move. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Sure feet. Go on. Trip. It'll be good for the ratings. <laughs> uh we can re-roll that. Okay, I guess we'll just push you. We'll push you over there. And we'll follow That'll up. Help the player move without risk. Let's just do some damage. Oh no. You won't go down because you've got blocked. People must be holding them up. But you're fine. I, I, they, they can't score. And I don't think that we can either. Really Let's see if we can tentacle him. It's big, long, and as Down he goes. Field, if you ask me. I hate tentacles. Now, we've only got one turn. And, yeah, we can't actually reach it. So what I'm going to do instead... What I'm going to do instead is... We're going to basically just try and push as many of these dickheads off into the crowd the as possible. Oh, no! It was the and in general, I thought we'd be fine. I really wanted players. to push them off into the crowd. There was three guys there. That would have been so good. The docks are doing their job. If they get pushed off into the crowds, then they instantly get injured. There's no armor save. All right. Well... No one scored. Uh, who's kicking off? Is it me? Am I kicking off or... I can never fucking remember. Um... Both of these teams are on the edge. Ball. This kick is crucial. Uh, players on the kicker team are removed and placed in different locations. Well, good job there. Uh, where's Cedric? Cedric, go and pick the fucking ball up. The ball the only, the only next? one I trust to do it. Right. Okay, we're going to move you up there. Oh, you can't move now, can you? Shit. Okay, you come down here. All right, we're going to create a little cage around our, around Cedric to protect him. The attacker has an assist. Let's do something like that. I will follow. Uh, yeah. That's fine. We'll follow you up there. You can come down here. Create a little box around our boy. All right. All right. Now we just need to break through their line. Which should be easy. Because they're Skaven. And they're very breakable. That. Oh, Got I can advice for the budding coach then, Bob? I can pick what happens. Yeah. That one. Unfortunate. Uh right. Let's get you over here. Let's get some friends nearby. Don't want you to rush. Open player in the opponent's half. You'll need shutting down or exploiting. Okay, then we do this. I should probably say something meaningful to all our Cabal Vision viewers. Well, I can 
think I'll follow him up. Splat. And we'll move up to assist. Let's give this guy a little punt. I can try and re-roll one of those. It's the same. Never mind. We both go down. Oh, but the rat ogre goes down, down. They no longer have a rat ogre. That's unfortunate for them. What are you up to? Oh, oh. Ouch! And another try bites the dirt. Oh, and he's out as well. I've seen some bad Blood Bowl matches in my time, and this is one of them. Rough. Uh, I kind of want to move you, but I'm going to move you up first. I'm going to... Right. Right, right. Let's... Right, let's think about this first, right? Let's move assistance up to help. Before we do anything else. Right, then we try and block I've you. Mushrooms that look smart than this. He has not... He's not done anything. Good. That's that's not great. Right, in that case, I want you up here to block you. And I want you up here to help out. And then I want you... Have I already, have I already blitzed this turn? Shit. All right, in that case, just go over there and basically be an annoyance. I think that's fine. If they want to... If they want to get past me, they're going to have to do dodge rolls, which is always... That last burst of just speed. float past me. Risky. Hey, I think a lot of dice. Class, Ooh, okay, we're fine. Nice. Rather stupidly, he didn't follow up, which actually works in our favor. And another <laughs> ratty's down. That's why I love this game. Right. Now, I am very... Basically, I could just run it in at this point. Or I could try and get some, some more injury rolls. The only thing is, if obviously we failed to get the injury roll... Don't, don't throw it to him. I mean, that's a pretty safe roll. A snotling baked in a pie stands more chance than this poor kid. hungry. Where's the nearest pie shop, Jim? That's a pretty safe. If we can maybe get an injury here, that would be nice. Lovely. Ah, that could have been better. Alright, let's... We only need a 2 plus. Don't fail. Perfect. Touchdown! The crowd goes wild. Not a figure of speech. They are going utterly wild. Feral even. Save yourselves! I wonder if I was killed, would I want to return to the game? Probably not. Probably well, not. Hitting the violence quota today. All right, their rat ogre is still out for the count. Uh, yeah, that's probably fine. I'll just boot it somewhere like there. Now, because obviously they've got a bunch of players out now, it does mean that we can now press our advantage and cause... Because a dodging Quick team really does require maneuverability. And if we can lock them down, so basically every time they move, it's an absolute fucking nightmare. They've got more chance of failing those dodge rolls and significantly more chance of getting a turnover. Which is why the schnip here is very useful. Because if we can just get him into the midst of a bunch of people... 
his tentacles really make moving around just a very annoying. Tentacles, good to have. Ooh, they're doing a little cage. A little cage action. Stay here, my little friend. Yeah, you're not going anywhere, mate. Yeah, they are just dicking about in their rear line, which is fine, I guess. My sus I, I suspect they want to try and break through. So... I'm actually tempted to, like... Say, just creating interlapping tackle zones. They want to break through. Good fucking luck. Um, yeah. Go, no big guy. Trample all over him. That's fine. I will push up. And you can just stay down there. That's okay. I'm happy with that. I'm going to wait for them to make the move. Decide they're going to have to decide which way they want to go. I just want I want to use up their rerolls so that every time they try and get past me, there's a high chance of them slipping on their ass. Oh, are they breaking, breaking right? Or should I say left? They're right. My left. Okay, that's fine. You wearing perfume, Jim? No, it's a scent. Very different from perfume, Bob. Do you like it? It's called Rotting Cadaver by Tommy Helfiger. Go on, spend a re-roll. You know you want to. Do it. Do it. The schnip is just an absolute nightmare for everyone. It's it's great. Fail dodge. That's going to be a turnover. Down he goes. Oh shit, he's dead. It's worse than that, he's dead, Jim. Any punch that can detach a head from the body is a boss in my He's dead. Did I get a new guy? Don't think I did. I can't remember when I check. Is it the end of the game? Right. You are risky to block because you do have block. Which is a problem. I am going to move you up. I'm going to give my boys some time to get up here, basically. So you get over there. If I blitz you, I get... Th Three, three on, dice. Guys, Higher chance of just kicking the shit you out of me. Okay, I'm gonna put you here. Unless I can put you here. Oh, I can. This guy leave his brain in the oh no, Schnip! Come on, mate. Come on. All right. All right, in that case. Let us... Do something like that. And then we'll try a little stampy stamp stamp. Oh no, we were spot... Okay, I'm gonna bribe the ref. Okay, anyone else moved? No, just you, but to be honest, I think you're fine. Did you know that the new Cabal HD globes have been selling like hotcakes from all outlets? Don't confuse the viewers, Jim. He means they've been selling fast, not that they're made out of cake and jam. Yeah. 
If you keep running backwards and forwards, you're never gonna you're never gonna score. Not like that. Like that. A timidity really worst reward. Down he goes. Anybody catch the ball tonight? Well, I'm trying. I'm really trying. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's not really a blitz. It's a slow waddle. There he goes. Uh, I can't re-roll it because it's a... Uh... players have finally remembered we're not playing soccer. I can't re-roll it because it was a blitz and not a block. Fast and impossible to tackle. The fans will it's fine. It. They're, they're not going to score in in two turns. They're not going to score in two turns. Okay, I'm going to move you up. And... I guess we're just going to push you. That's quite a mess. Even Seamch would struggle to untangle that. I think we can... Yeah, he's fine. I would really like to get my hands on someone. I it's it's always risky fouling someone. Player down and surrounded by the opposing team. This yeah. Isn't going to be pretty. It is not, no. Oh, ouch! <laughs> the fur really did fly. Okay, I don't think we can really do anything else. I mean, we could blitz. But... Uh, let's fucking go for it. He won't leave him alone any time soon. All right. Okay, um, that's fine. What are you going to do now? Gone, fall over. That's a good choice for this play. It really wasn't. Don't hey, power me. That play looked almost competent. Oh shit! Just stuns. Uh, push me. Push That's me, baby, one ball. more time. But they've wisely decided not to. He didn't see the opponents around him, did he? Uh, let's do that one. He's away with the fairies. He better watch oh, out. shit, son. Little beasts. Okay, well, one of my boys is down, but lots of theirs are. I'm okay with that. Is. Was that match? I thought it went for 24 turns. All right, fine, whatever. Anyway, so we won because we got the one, the one touchdown, which is good. We actually, I think we lost some. I think we. Oh no, we did. We did. We did get some more dedicated fans. That's good. We got a little bit more money. That's good. So we've got 90, 90k in the bank, which sounds like a lot, but isn't isn't really that much. So, Jalen got four SPP. Cedric got three. Cedric's really just like, Eckert the Lich. Who the fuck are you? Eckert the Lich. 
Oh, oh it's just a line man, isn't he? Just one of our one of our line man boys. Right, so if we go back to teams. So I don't think we've got enough SPP to give anyone any skills. Now there's there's options here. So basically what you can do, you can pick a skill. And there's primary and secondary skills. Secondary skills cost more. Um, the, the amount of SPP you need each time increases. However, what you can do is, is choose a random skill. That'll pick a random one that you don't have. And that's always half the amount. But obviously, you don't get to pick it. But like, oh, you can get like mutation, like claws. And a player with this skill knocked down an opponent. The latter's armor value is always broken on an unmodified resolve for 8+. plus. Ooh. Some of the, I mean, like, tentacles is just really good. Two heads is always quite fun. Prehensile tail. I think it's one of the things that if you get, like, some really good mutations, you could make your your particular character into, like, a, a really good, like, thrower, catcher, dodger. They always have horns, obviously. But then you've got someone like the... Nor I mean, to be honest, I don't think... Nurgle is ever going to play a passing game. So, like, passing is probably not that useful. Agility? Yeah, maybe. You're probably mostly going to go for strength, right? Things like Mighty Blow. That would be quite good. Um, block. Is Blocker... Guards... Yeah, je so Block is really, really good. And blocks are really good because when you have the both down roll on a on a blocking dice, that just that just counts as a push, I think, or it doesn't affect you. Is it do dodge is the one where it's like defender stumbles, isn't it? That, that that just acts like a push down. So basically, if you have block and dodge at the same time, your character is very hard to take down. Like, you're going to really struggle to, to, to get that guy down. What does this button do? I don't know what it does, and I was terrified to press it. Um, could I buy... What I want is a re-roll, to be honest. But 140,000, that's very... I feel like you probably should have some re-rolls just to start off with. I feel like taking none at the start, bad idea. My guess is that Nurgle is a as a um, team, is probably quite expensive. How much are our boys? 75,000, blows 150. I think that is quite expensive. The linemen are only 35, but they're not very good, to be honest. I mean, they're still quite tanky, but the, the chance on on taking more more damage from casualties. I can't believe Eckert the Lich just... I don't know what he was up to, but he was doing some really good stuff. But Cedric, definitely, definitely kicking ass. He's already up to three S SPP after getting, after getting sure hands. That did help actually during that match because he would have failed to pick up the ball otherwise. I can't remember if that is a turnover or not. I have a sneaky suspicion it is. Pretty much everything's a turnover. Anything bad that happens is probably a turnover. Frankly, I'm amazed failing the stupid roll for the schnip wasn't counted as a as a turnover. But still. So obviously we could then go into uh, playing our next match against the Dance of Cain. Which is quite fun. So Blood Bowl 3. I, I, I love Blood Bowl. And this is basically just Blood Bowl video game. It even worked quite well on my Steam Deck. It didn't work great, but it was okay. And I'll be interested to see if they're actually going to going to to optimize it for Steam Deck. Because, I mean, it, it it's for consoles as well, so I don't see why not. Anyway, Blood Bowl 3 is out on the 23rd of February. It might have microtransactions. That's the only thing I'd say, because this Warp Zone stuff, I think, is probably microtransactions. There's a shop, and you can buy a whole bunch of extra stuff there. And I guess it's only cosmetic, which is fine. Um, but I, I don't know how I feel about that. I would much prefer that to be like an in-game thing. But I, I guess you can play online, so you do kind of get that prestige type thing. But I don't know. I, 
I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. Depending on what the chaos stuff looks like, of course. And they're probably going to bring out a bunch of new teams. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.